Ever wondered what secrets lurk beneath the vast, unexplored depths of our world's oceans? The truth is, the deep blue sea carries within its depths an array of mysteries waiting to be unraveled. A realm so vast, it covers more than 70% of our planet's surface and yet, it remains largely unexplored. Our oceans are the final frontier right here on Earth, a place where light fades into an abyss of darkness, where pressure mounts to unimaginable levels, and where temperatures fluctuate wildly. This underwater universe is a world that defies human exploration, a world that seems to reject our intrusion, yet, it is that very challenge that fuels our curiosity. The harder it is to reach, the more we yearn to uncover its secrets. It is like a siren call to the explorers among us, an irresistible lure to those with an insatiable appetite for discovery. Deep sea exploration is no walk in the park. It's a complex and perilous endeavor, one that requires cutting edge technology, significant resources, and a daring spirit. The deeper you go, the more hostile the environment becomes. The immense pressure can crush submarines like an aluminum can, the frigid temperatures can freeze equipment, and the utter darkness can render navigation nearly impossible. Despite these challenges, humanity is not deterred. Our desire to understand the world around us, to push the boundaries of our knowledge and experience, drives us to venture where few have dared to go. The ocean's depths, filled with strange creatures and alien landscapes, hold the promise of new insights into life on Earth and beyond. Our pursuit of knowledge has led to remarkable findings, discoveries that have revolutionized our understanding of the world. Unusual life forms, sunken treasures and remnants of past civilizations have all been found beneath the waves. Yet, there is so much more to discover, so many secrets yet to be unearthed from the depths of our world's oceans. Just when we thought we knew it all, what they discovered underwater shocked the whole world. The year is 1977 and a group of scientists stumbles upon something extraordinary. Deep beneath the ocean's surface in the darkness, away from the reach of sunlight, they found something that would forever change our understanding of life on Earth. It was a world teeming with life, a world that was thought to be too hostile for any living creature. And yet, there it was. This was the discovery of hydrothermal vents. These vents, formed by underwater volcanoes, spew out mineral-rich water heated to extreme temperatures by the Earth's magma. The surrounding seawater, chillingly cold and pitch black, would seem inhospitable to most forms of life. But not here. Against all odds, life found a way. The researchers were baffled. How could anything survive, let alone thrive in such extreme environments? But as they looked closer, they noticed something remarkable. Surrounding these vents were diverse ecosystems, bustling with life forms never seen before. There were giant tube worms, some reaching lengths of 8 feet, clams with shells as big as dinner plates and shrimp that had evolved to cope with the harsh conditions. These creatures had developed unique adaptations to survive. They didn't rely on sunlight for energy, as most life on Earth does. Instead, they depended on bacteria living inside them that could convert the chemicals spewing from the vents into energy, a process known as chemosynthesis. This discovery was groundbreaking. It expanded our understanding of life and its potential to exist in the harshest of conditions. It opened up the possibility that life could exist elsewhere in our universe, on planets previously deemed uninhabitable. In the midst of the deep, dark ocean, these scientists had stumbled upon a world thriving with life, a world that existed independently of the sun's energy. It was an oasis in the darkness, a testament to life's resilience and adaptability. Little did they know this was just the beginning. Fast forward to 2000, an underwater city that's not built by humans but by nature itself. Picture an underwater metropolis, teeming with life, color, and movement. This is the Great Barrier Reef one of the seven natural wonders of the world. But it's not just a spectacle of beauty, it's a complex ecosystem, a living, breathing city beneath the waves. This underwater city stretches over 2,300 kilometers, larger than the Great Wall of China, and the only living thing visible from space. It's composed of over 2 million individual coral colonies, creating a vibrant, intricate network of life. But the Great Barrier Reef is more than just a home to a multitude of marine species. It's a lifeline for our planet. The coral reefs form a mighty barrier that protects our coasts from the full force of the waves, storms, and floods. They are the rainforests of the sea, producing a third of the world's oxygen, absorbing carbon dioxide and providing a crucial habitat for countless species. The biodiversity of this underwater city is staggering. From the tiny, vibrant clownfish to the majestic humpback whale, the Great Barrier Reef is a bustling metropolis of marine life. 
It's a place where every organism, no matter how small, plays a vital role in maintaining the delicate balance of the ecosystem. Yet this city beneath the waves is under threat. The rising temperatures, ocean acidification and pollution are causing the corals to bleach and die. It's a stark reminder of the fragility of our natural world and the impact our actions can have on it. Our understanding of this underwater city has grown, stirring a sense of awe and concern for its preservation. It's a testament to the marvels of nature, a city built not by human hands but by the intricate dance of life and time. But the ocean had yet more secrets to reveal. In 2012, a giant was found sleeping in the depths of the Antarctic Ocean. This was not a mythical sea monster or a figment of sailors' tall tales. This was a real living creature, one that had eluded human understanding for centuries. It was the colossal squid, the largest known squid species, a true titan of the deep. The colossal squid is a creature of superlatives. It's the heaviest squid species with mature adults weighing in at half a ton. Its body can stretch to lengths of over 16 feet, with tentacles that can extend even further. And its eyes, each the size of a dinner plate, are the largest in the entire animal kingdom. Its discovery was a game changer. For centuries the ocean's depths were thought to be a lifeless abyss, too harsh and too cold for anything to survive. But the colossal squid, thriving in the icy Antarctic waters shattered this misconception. Here was a creature that not only survived but thrived in conditions we deemed inhospitable. It was a testament to the resilience of life, and a reminder of how much we still have to learn about our own planet. The discovery of the colossal squid sparked a renewed interest in deep-sea exploration. If such a gigantic creature could lie hidden for so long, what else could be lurking in the ocean's depths? Scientists began to delve deeper exploring the darkest corners of the sea with new vigor and enthusiasm. Each expedition brought with it the promise of new discoveries, and the potential to rewrite our understanding of marine life. The colossal squid is more than just an underwater giant. It's a symbol of the vast, untapped potential that lies beneath the waves. It's a reminder that the ocean, covering more than two-thirds of our planet, is still largely unexplored territory, filled with mysteries waiting to be solved. And then came the discovery that left everyone speechless. The colossal squid was just the beginning. The depths of the ocean had more secrets to reveal, secrets that would shock the whole world. In 2021, the ocean revealed a secret that shocked the whole world. And this secret was not a lost city or a hidden giant, but something even more remarkable. A vast underwater river flowing beneath the Black Sea. This was not a mere trickle of water but a full-fledged river. It was discovered by a team of marine biologists and oceanographers, who were studying the unique ecosystem of the Black Sea. While conducting a deep-sea exploration, they picked up on something unusual. Their sonar readings showed a strong continuous current flowing at a depth where no current should exist. Intrigued, they decided to investigate further. What they found was an underwater river, complete with trees, leaves and other organic matter that one would typically find on the banks of a terrestrial river. It was as if a slice of the terrestrial world had been transported underwater. The river was flowing along a channel it had carved out for itself, much like rivers do on land. This discovery was not just surprising, it was mind-boggling. It challenged our understanding of underwater ecosystems. It showed us that the ocean's depths are not just a vast, unchanging expanse but a dynamic and evolving landscape. The existence of this underwater river has significant implications. It suggests that there could be similar rivers in other parts of the world's oceans. These rivers could play a crucial role in the transport of nutrients and organic matter, influencing marine biodiversity and possibly even the global climate. Furthermore, the discovery of this underwater river has opened up a new frontier for exploration and research. It holds the promise of uncovering even more secrets about our oceans, leading to new discoveries and breakthroughs. The ocean, it seems, will never cease to surprise and amaze us. Just when we think we've seen it all, it reveals another secret, another marvel, reminding us of the vastness and mystery of the world beneath the waves.